Hey everybody, Miss Sweet here from Miss Sweet's Crafting Therapy. How are all my sweet unicorns doing? And, oops, I did it again. This time, this is a complete uh, diamond painting haul. So I think I have about eight or nine diamond paintings and a couple of accessories. Um, bear with me, un momento. I need to see if I can pull up my order on my, I don't know if I can on my lap, on my, you, let's see, orders. So I can kind of tell you the cost of everything. Uh, buy this again, shit, delivered. Ah, yes. All right, let's, good, got it, no, yes, got it. Okay, so, I did just open the package, um, so I'm just going to take this down now off the table, and we're just going to take things out one at a time. So, all right, the first one I have, this is a 30 by 40 diamond painting. There's going to be crinkling, I'm forewarning you, okay? Can't help it. Nature of the beast. All right. So it's a poured glue. Which means I can do this. And it's not going to hurt the canvas. Alright. So this one. I don't, I'm not going to be able to I think, get it all in. Uh, okay. That's a little better. So it's buckle up buttercup. You just flipped my witch switch. Hmm. And <laughs> I'm not exactly sure what that cat is holding. Um, it looks like it might be a lighter. I don't know. Um, <laughs> uh, or maybe maybe it's just a book. I, I don't know. Maybe a book now. Now that I look. All right. Let me take back my evil thoughts of a lighter and going to set somebody up. But um, it might be just a book. It might be a spell book. Okay. That would make more sense since the cat is black and wearing a witch's hat. Yeah, that would make more sense, Deb. So, 30 by 40, there are 21 colors. It is a full drill, and it is round. And you always get your typical standard kit, the pen, your wax, they, they give you this one, they give you a little uh, finger protector, and they do give you some baggies. Uh, let's we'll give a quick look. Again, crinkling people, can't help it. Some of y'all like it, so suck it up, buttercup. All right. Oh, yeah, I'm a little upside down, but yeah, you can see the colors. Of course, lots of black, and we got reds and purples and a nice coral. All right, your basic colors. No specials. This is a budget painting from Timu, um, you're never really gonna find ABs in this. And this one was $4.98. Let's see, bear with me. Yes, I am putting this back. I don't have all the space in the world. Um, so I need to rein this in and get it all back together. Voila. We got this. Uh, sticky. They're always usually sticky. Yeah, no problem. Uh, drill field is very clear. So it'll probably come out very good. Oh, yeah. So buckle up, Buttercup. Oh. And we are going to wrap this back up for now. I'm currently working on, um, I was working on mandala um, coasters, you know, for glasses coaster. Um, and I finished them. So I started working on my 
little mini Care Bear keychains. Um, so that's what I'm working on now. I think I have one more of my older um, keychain kits, which is another gnome uh, set. Come on now. All right, we'll come back to you on that. Um, and then I think I'm going to kit up one of the diamond paint, um, diamond art club ones that I have. Ah, okay. So this one is another, I think 30 by 40, which is 12 by 16, um, full drill. And I'm sure this is round as well. I don't look anymore. It's round or square. Don't matter. And I have a friend who is a complete horror fan and loves Stephen King's It. So we have It. <laughs> so 30 by 40, 21 colors. <coughs> I'm not going to bother. There's not really pretty, pretty ones. There's some reds, but mostly blacks, grays, variations of gray and some maroons. So it is a dark picture, but his balloon's got to be red. And it looks like there's a lot of confetti in that red. It looks clear. And this one was for 08. 90 cents cheaper than the cat one. I guess not many people want Stephen King's It. And again, standard kit, except this one didn't come with a finger cushion. <coughs> By the way, I keep the baggies. I keep the wax, the rest of the stuff. Um, I used to save them because they're in my complex. There was a teacher. And I used to save these trays for her. Um, because they'd use them in the school when the kids did finger painting or something like that. So to put some paint, they would use them little trays to, with the kids with finger painting. Okay, this one is a 20 by 30. This is a little guy, which is like seven by 11, almost eight and a half by 11, almost, not quite. <laughs> and it's Tasmanian Devil. Uh, you can see this is quite the little guy. I just thought he was cute. Again, standard kit. And this guy's got 18 colors. And of course, round. Most of your uh, budget friendly um, diamond paintings a lot of times are round. Oh, and this one's already pre kitted. Look at that. Oh, with the numbers and everything on it. That's cool. We got some oranges, maroons, a little bit of blue, some white where he's breaking out, lots of browns. And like I said, oh, this one was $2.98. And when I put them back, I don't put those uh, little standard kits back in because I don't use them. I don't need them. So I'll take them apart, take what I'll use and get rid of what I want. Okay. Next up, what do we got? Ah, more keychains. <laughs> hey, they're quick. They're fun. I can use them as tags on gifts. Um, and that's kind of what I've done with them. This one is Flippy Flops. Flip Flop keychains. Oh, there's two stuck together there. And they're back and front. So you do paint both sides.
there is a protective coating on these that you have to peel off of both sides. Oh, come on, there we go. So there's a dozen, so there's 12. And of course you get the clips with the ball chain, your standard clip, wax, baggies, tray, pen. And these all tend to be the crystal uh, diamonds. And of course round. So we've got all these pretty crystals to use. If I go that way, you can see it a little better. Those will work out pretty. Um, so yeah, you can use them as ornaments for your tree, whether it be your Christmas or if you do like a seasonal tree. So this would make a nice little summer tree. Um, obviously they're keychains, use them as keychains. <laughs> or um, uh, tags, gift tags. Just to decorate the package. Yes. Those. Next. What do we got? We have another 30 by 40. I think I was in a witchy mood. Excuse me, so you can see what this one is. Let me just do this real quick. So 30 by 40 being 12 by 16 or, um, well, in the rain. Well, okay, the full canvas would be 12 by 16. Um, what you're actually painting is uh, 11 by, 11.8 by almost 16, 15.7 inches. That's your actual um, area that you're painting. This is a full drill, round. The canvas has even got a glitter uh, in it. So it's one of those nice little glittery. So behind your drills, it's also going to have glitter. I don't know. You it's So it's hard to, for the camera to pick this up. But you guessed it. It's just a bunch of hocus pocus. And just the girl's hair. I think that's adorable. And then we got a bunch of Halloween colors. Lots of black. There's that one. And this one was $3.98. Oh, I never told you how much the 12-piece flip-flop was. The 12-piece flip-flop was $7.58. Now, I've noticed that anything that is off canvas, which is what they tend to call those types of projects, uh, are more money than the projects that are canvas. So that's, and I think that's just for the nature of the item. They're smaller. I think they're harder to produce. More involved in producing them, I should say, than just a canvas. All right, what else we got in here? We got more. Oh, what's this one? All right, what do we got? Um, all right. And I did purchase all this with my own funds. This is not sponsored by Timu. They did not send me any of this. So, just so you know. So there's no sponsorship involved here. Come on now, come out of there. I don't like these new bags. Urgh. What do we got? Oh, okay. 
This is a 40 by 30. And this is a uh, Gnome's Day at the Beach or the Lake. Even watermelon, sunbathing, floating in the water on some tubes. So this one has 22 colors. And 40 by 30 being about 15 by 12, 16 by 12, something in that area. And it, I'm not going to open up all the diamonds, guys. You can kind of see the colors. And they're round. Oops, sorry, I hit you. Now, and all of these look good as far as uh, clarity. <coughs> I don't see any issues with reading any of the symbols, nor did I see in any of the previous ones. So, that's always good. This is another little keychain set. And this one cost me $9.48. <laughs> More money than the 12 piece flip flops. And this one is only six pieces. Uh, but you'll see what they got me for. Even though I'm sure this is not Disney approved. But we have. Or actually, you go this way. Some springtime Eastery um, Disney esque <laughs> keychains. So, again, you get your keychains with the bone chain there. Standard toolkit. And this one is regular round um, drills. So, this one's not even crystal drills. So this one was a, mm, a lot of money for this, but they're cute. I like them. Um, good for Easter next year. <laughs> and of course they're, they're all like a plastic and they're double sided. So you drill both sides. Alright, let's see what's next in that good old orange bag. Oh. Mm, I gotta really dig down now. We're getting there. Yep. Alright, now they're 30 by 30. There it is. That's it right there. Come on now. Come on, don't do this to me. All right, now we're going to take out, because I don't want to rip the bag completely. I want to be able to put it back in. So we're just going to open it up there. And as I destroy my desk. So this is just a little square guy. This is like 12 by 12, something like that. Yeah, 30 by 30 is 12 by 12, and it's just a Tinkerbell. And she was $3.38. Standard toolkit. And round drills. And the canvas is pretty cool. Another one with those that are glittery canvas. Uh, it should work out good. Work up good. 24 colors. All right, let's see. 
What will we bust out next? Oh, come on. Get back in the bag, please. Thank you. Falling over now. All right, what's this one? Oh, okay. I got, see, one of the, what's this? Oh, um, I decided just to see what these pens were like. These are standard uh, acrylic pens, um, but they came with this little kit. So you don't have to use those little pink things. And by the way, I also don't keep these tips. These brass, <coughs> these brass tips they put on here, they bend and they chip. So if you use them for any amount of time, they're no good. They won't pick up drills because they bend and they get rough. Um, I do use stainless steel tips. So any pen I use, if it comes with a tip other than a stainless steel tip, I replace it. This was a little kit with two pens. And this was $3.98. And these are resin. That was the word I was looking for earlier on the keychain things. Those are resin. So they gave you extra tips and multi-placers. And that's usually what happened. You put a single placer on one end and a multi-placer on the other. Uh, that works. The multi-placers work great when you're color blocking. So we got two sets of tips, two pens, a boat, a regular boat, a little square boat. These are good for um, your big jams, your jam ones. Uh, they tend to be a little bigger, so they get tougher to get out of these lines. If you notice, these trays are lined, and that's there isn't a measurement. There's a science to these trays um, to hopefully be big enough uh, to fit the drill so they line up. So you'll find people put them in and then they shake them. It's to get them to line up and face upright. And then, oh, this isn't a good opaque. It's not very clear. Um, opaque is better than the clearer pink wax. So quite a few chunks of wax. Of course, I have tons of these. Those are gone. Tips, goodbye. Um, but you, I mean, you don't, you don't need to do that. I also have steel multi-placers, so um, that I place in mine. So those are pretty. So those are what I will keep. And then this is also an off, off the canvas project. Here's another one that read: beware of size. And when they put things in centimeters, you just don't realize what is it really in inches. So this really turned out a lot smaller than I thought it was going to be. Um, and what are we looking at? We are looking at not quite, oh, maybe eight inches <laughs> wide or long. And uh, uh, a little above seven. <laughs> the other way, so seven by eight, eight by seven. Um, this looks like it's been around a while. It's yellowed. Um, but this one is uh, partial. You don't paint everything. And actually, I'm looking at this, there's not very much you paint. But this is a little hanger. You can hang this in a window or on your door. I don't know. But, oh, ooh, tiny, tiny teardrops. Those are special drills. Um, and these are the, oh, these ones are pretty. I like the iridescent clear. Oh, and this is what they would call an AB. It's a regular resin drill with a special coating on it. That's the drills. And then it comes with your standard kit and also the hanging chain. Um, and it's got the little clips, so it'll hang. And when 
not keeping this. And this one was, where are you? $7.18. So yeah, another one of those, oops. I didn't pay attention to the size very well, but it's still cute. I'm gonna make a nice gift for somebody. Paint it up. I think I put this in the wrong bag, didn't I? Yeah, I did. We'll just, we'll just do that. There, a little better. Cause that one doesn't close. And then, Next to last, they had the portfolio books. Uh, bear with me here. We're going to just. Oh, they really wrap these. Oh, my goodness. So much garbage. These are display books. A3 size, which this does fit a 30 by 40 and under paintings. But I also thought, now these were two for $11.98, so about six bucks each. Sorry about the crinkles. Um, it will hold, sorry guys, wow, it will hold 30. Um, paintings back to front. There's 30 sheets, so actually 60 it can hold. So, um, yeah, I have quite the stash. Um, maybe one day I'll do a diamond painting stash video of how many I have in my stash. Um, yeah, it might be scary. Um, but yeah, that's what I bought these for. I even put finished. I have them already that I put uh, finished ones that I haven't decided to frame or give away. Um, so I don't get rid of everything I do, but I do store them in these booklets. So I can always go back and look at them. And again, I hit you again. Sorry, guys. All right, we can get rid of, oh, this smells awful. Very plasticky. And then the last thing was I got this little free gift. That's just, uh, it just said stone on a chain. It didn't give you a choice. Oh, it's pretty, I guess. This is just a little, it's a, it's string, but coated string. Oh, it's kind of cute. So that was a free gift. And that, my friends, is my Timu haul this time. Um, yeah, I think there's a couple more coming. I don't know if I will um, do openings of them because some of it's not craft stuff. I can't remember. I, I don't remember everything. I don't know. I'll see once it gets here. Um, but I hope you enjoyed me sharing this with you. Let me know your comments down below. And uh, yeah, comment, like, subscribe. Um, that's the best way to support me and my channel. Um, so yeah. All right, guys. See you real soon. Bye now. Mm -hmm.